I want to watch the VR trailer though. Toy, oh wait, what do they call this? The Toycon 04 VR kit. There's so many things that I was waiting to watch on camera with niggas. So fuck it, let's go. Anybody still playing Nintendo Labo actively right now? I remember seeing memes and references for like a week and then that was it. Little Timmy here seems like he's pretty excited to get his VR on though. What the fuck is that thing? What? What the hell? Labo VR kit. Listen, if we if you if you know how VR works, the, the, the reason why you get motion sickness is because the quality of the image isn't all that high. The tablet of the Switch pushes 720p. I think the minimum for VR is like for you to be comfortable is like 4K or something. So yeah, I don't know how they The Nintendo Labo VR kit is packed with everything you need to make Toy Con creations that let you enjoy simple. Alright, is this really gonna VR be usable? And experience it. All you have to add is your Nintendo Switch system. Gaze into the toy car VR to... goggles. No matter where you look, a virtual environment awaits. I'm That's about to toss the chunks of VR. Making your toy con creations is where the fun starts. Just follow the interactive instructions in the included software, and you're on your way. Insert your Nintendo Switch console once you've finished building your first creation, and bam! You're ready to play. Okay. You can use your Toy-Con VR goggles on their own, or by attaching them to one of the other creations you can build. Like this bad boy here. Some Google First up, the Toy-Con Blaster. You shoot niggas? Pull back the slide to Whoa. the blaster. Take aim, and fire away. That looks kinda cool. aliens are invading. From above. Whoa. To the right, no matter where they are, take them out. Why does this look like the use virtual the boy though? to lock onto distant enemies. Rotate the Joy-Con holder on the side of the Toy-Con blaster, and you can even stop time itself. Line up the perfect shot. Like Bayonetta? And then play it cool. Like Dio? It's no big deal. Whoa. Just uh, remember, the battle ain't over till you go head-to-head -head with the boss. A Sonic the Hedgehog looking ass boss. In this game, you can face off against another Hungry, player. hungry hippo? Use the blaster to suck up fruit and then shoot it into a hippo's mouth. Okay. If you manage to feed one, the shoot in the hippo's mouth. to your side of the arena. Take turns with the Toy Con Blaster and see who can win the hearts of the biggest horde of hippos. Look at the Zai Wild! Hungry, hungry hippo! What if I want to shoot my, Next, my, my opponent? The Toy Con Wind Pedal. Yep, that's a toy huh? bear firing balls at your little froggy friend. Better hop over those things. Press huh? down on this Toy Con creation with your foot and you'll feel a gust of air swoosh by. Oh, so you. Kind of like when you really jump. Keep clearing the balls those toy bears toss, and you can climb that stately stack of spears all the way to the stars. I never built a, a toy con Look before, out. man. If a ball rains down I wanted rock, to. Use your head, a, uh, a header, to knock it away. You know what to do, frog friend. Dodge those balls. balls and reach for the sky. <laughs> Dodge Next, those balls. Toy con bird. Toy con bird? Uh, what is Nintendo doing out here? What are these? What are these creations? Squeeze the grips to make what the are they doing its out here? And tilt the toy what the here. fuck is going yeah, on in Nintendo? So they can grow up These niggas are thinking on another level. Then join your flock. Raise all the little hatchlings, and pretty soon you'll rule the sky. I gotta take a hit just for this. Ready to try out faster flight? Then soar through checkpoints and head for the goal in bird dash. What the fuck you doing? You doing? You on the fucking pedal? You doing this? What the fuck gonna? This one is the Toy-Con Elephant. Toy-Con Elephant? Use its trunk to paint 3D pictures what that the hang in thin fuck? air. Why would I do you this? You can even grab your creations I and mean, move them down. around. I mean, damn. There's an eraser. It, it looks interesting. 3D? Shape tools. Wow, you make... Effects pens and even lighting effects. So I'm supposed to keep my head Use in there to, to do it? To craft some true masterpieces. Bro, I don't know if my Move eyes are gonna... to lead a marble to the goal in Marble Run. That's some... <laughs> you know, I saw a meme. Okay, I remember seeing online, um, somebody had made a post. And uh, let, me, <laughs> let me see if I can actually pull that shit up real quick. I, I gotta show y'all this. Because it, it was completely relevant to that. I, I was wondering actually where I had seen that that clip and now i know the fucking uh, elephant thing where was that shit at 
I know I saved that shit somewhere here. No, where are you at? Where you at? Oh, oh, by the way, there's another nigga that I need to fucking give a shout out to. This nigga is absolutely fucking crazy. Look at this dude. Posting a fucking picture of me with the fucking shirt with the dude who's all like, oh, yeah, you know, I had to do it to him. And he's got that shit on with me and on his shirt. So it's like three niggas holding on. To <laughs> he's got three niggas on his damn shirt, man. I like it. Very, very clean. You, you, you're a legend, my friend. I already like the post, but I mean, yeah, much respect to you, man. Nintendo, though, in terms of what the fuck they're trying, they're living in, are they living in the year 3000? Or are, are they, they're, they're doing some other shit right now, man. Like, what in the fuck? Oh, wait, oh, no, I was trying to find that post. Where is it? This is absolutely worth it. All I need to do is locate it. It's probably all the way down. I like so many posts now. Oh, by the way, speaking of liked posts, this one I definitely got to give a whole lot of love, man. Uh, barefoot waifu all day. I already saved the image. I might save it again just for the camera because, I mean, fuck it, man. That's definitely a fucking solid-ass image right there. Oh, wait, hold on. I, I, of course, I know y'all mostly saw this in my video, but this definitely deserves some notoriety right here. Just based on the fact that... <laughs> Listen, I can cook in the kitchen and I can eat some ass too, okay? Excuse me? Yo, what? What's up? I'm streaming. I just came down to let you know I'm leaving in the morning. Oh, okay. See His you. mom's leaving in the morning. You kind of freaking texted me or something. I'm freaking streaming. You <laughs> oh, my God. He's so <laughs> fucked up. <laughs> I'm just being funny for the stream. How you say in front of moms that you're going to eat some ass? It was just straight up. She was like, excuse Listen, me? I can cook in the kitchen and I can eat some ass too, okay? Classic, classic right there. I'm going to use that clip for years to come, man. EE -E is one fuck medical ban. <laughs> Bro, listen. Listen, man. The, the nigga... If I get banned for just that corn picture, then it'll and then maybe YouTube isn't the platform for us after all. You know what I'm saying? Uh, hold on, let me let me see if I can pull this fucking image. Uh, man, I like so many posts now. I guess this shit is fucking lost in the sauce. Or maybe I actually responded to it. Uh, it, it was like um trying to compare that image to. Let me see. There we go. I found it. Yes. Yes, it's like it's like the fucking Zelda, the the Zelda boss. Oh, and speaking of which, you know I never actually beat. Um, Breath of the Wild, and I never got spoiled to what the ending is, and I literally have the game played right up to the point where you, like, take out the last beast, and then you can beat it, and so I don't know. I mean, I don't want to get spoiled, and clearly something crazy happens at the end, because everyone, like, saying that the game is amazing, or, but then again, no, I remember people saying the ending was actually lackluster, and to, um, compared to what they actually thought it felt, or felt like it should be. But anyways, let's just get back to this fucking, um, toy con shit real quick. Hands on twisty tubes. And maybe I will play a little bit of Breath of the Wild later on, though. I might fire up the Switch real soon, actually. It might be time to start gaming soon. How many how many viewers do we currently have in the stream, man? It is 328. 18 hours, 45 minutes left, man. Still going strong. I don't know where the fuck y'all at, but I'm right here. Trampoline. Right, let me go back a little bit. Your disposal to craft some true masterpieces. Move objects to lead a marble to the goal in Marble Run. You'll get your hands okay. on twisty tubes, trampolines, fans, and even anti-gravity devices. What in the hell? Try Who's you've got this, right? Who at Why Nintendo not try is thinking of all this too? Now for the Toy-Con camera. They're really... Find your subject. Zoom watch it right. Yeah, we'll watch it soon. And snap. With the Toy-Con camera, taking underwater pictures in a virtual ocean is easy. It's... And a cute little creature relaxing in its house is an Yo. instant photo op. It's like some Pokemon there Snap type to shit. tackle too. Ain't always easy making memories. The VR games Remember, are cool, but... you can look in any direction. <laughs> um, Poopy McFartface says... Wait, by the way, I've seen you around in the chat before too. Um, Poopy McFartface says, The VR games are cool, but you look fucking stupid using them. Yeah, I, I agree, man. They, like, like if I... I mean, especially the elephant one. Like, why have the fucking trunk in the first... They're, they're being creative, though. I'm not gonna hate on them. They're coming at it from a different angle. And props to Nintendo for experimenting rather than just biting off of shit. Kind of like how Sony is all the time, you know? But I guess they always win, and huh? you never know what you'll find. So that Pokemon Snap. 
VR Plaza is loaded with 64 more bite-sized games and experiences. They're really trying to push 64. this cardboard. Abduct stuff as a UFO? Drive a virtual car? Nigga said 64. Wow. <laughs> Bro's trying to play this shit up, man. I don't know if I'm excited for the toy con cardboard shit that, that much, but I mean. Games and experiences. Listen to how he said it. 64. <laughs> The emphasis. I, I love it. Duck stuff as a UFO? Drive a virtual car? Rock out? Even control gravity. All in VR. Wow! Games, you just need Joy-Con controllers. For others, you'll use your different Toy-Con creations. You blow the shit? How do they even make and that? guess work? what? Nintendo Labo VR Kit lets you make your own VR games and experiences too. What? That's where our brand new tool, Dogs, they got way VR, too comes. much. They're when doing do it all. This, what should happen? Here, programming is as simple as linking together inputs and outputs. For example, you could set up a mannequin and then decide what it should do. Choose its size and more. So you even control your character freely. Could you? Wow, this is so interesting. Lay out some terrain. Okay. It's starting Set to get up crazy. Some obstacles. Add some finishing touches by the goal. 64. You got a game. Not bad. You could make a high speed tuna racer. What kind of shit? A lunar rover. A mechanical clock. Or even an epic quest for sushi. They're your game. A whole RPG. You're the designer. And you can oh, do wow. it all. You know damn well I'm gonna be way too lazy to do half of that shit. Now you're interested. I mean, I'll play niggas' creations. I ain't making nothing with this shit, though. You know how much effort that looks like it takes? I, I ain't got no time for that. But I respect Simple, friendly, fun. Nintendo Labo VR Kit. Okay. There's also a Nintendo Labo VR Kit starter set and blaster. That's a great entry point into the world of Nintendo Labo VR. The starter set includes the Nintendo Switch software, plus all the It's to cardboard! The VR goggles and toy <laughs> it's blaster. fucking cardboard! Okay. Okay. Yo. Even though I know how VR normally would need, like, way better hardware, I they, they kind of sold me a little bit on it, to be honest with you. I'm sort of, like, feeling a little bit like, damn, may, maybe Nintendo VR does have a future, bro. Kind of, like, kind of hard to imagine, but I mean, hey. Um, a frog.